Hey guys, and welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 2! Last time, uh, there was a lot of people who got shot, and, uh, I stabbed a dog after it bit me. And, uh, now we are, uh, locked in a shed because some people found us, and they think they're suspicious about the bite. So, yeah, we're locked in a shed, and now we're going to escape. Against my better judgment, we're gonna try to escape. Okay. This seems really dumb. They have a doctor. He's gotta have stuff for stitches. Oh no. Okay. Find a way into the cabin, obtain a needle, peroxide, and some bad are you serious? I gotta go, like, super stealth mode. Oh my god, this is totally... I can do this. Okay, so I can't... Can I look through the window? <clears throat> Ow. I think it's getting worse. Okay. Try the window. <clears throat> Come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, it's back here. Okay, windows that I can't reach. Aha! This one. Guaranteed. It's this one. Oh. Well, I... I don't know what I expected. <laughs> oh, here we go! This is it! Uh, no, no, I wanted to look at it. Yeah. No. Use the hammer. Okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. House meeting in five minutes. That's, that's good. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Okay. Fine. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a trap door? Use knife on trap door? Uh... Okay. Oh no! Well, let's open at least. Maybe made my decision. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Uh, did I do anything else? So wait, wait, where am I? Am I like in the middle of the house? Okay, kitchen door. I guess I'll listen for now. You don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. Whoever she's with. Oh crap. You think we could bring her in here? No, I'm just saying it wouldn't look too good. It's just a precautionary measure. Anyone else would do the same. Okay. Carver. I don't know who that is. <coughs> okay. I noticed that if I kept listening, they would have eventually spotted me. Alright, what do we got here? Ok, 
Okay, birds. Oh, birds. Damn birds. What's over here? Is there anything? Let's see. Uh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I saw a bunch of names. That's a poster? Duck. <laughs> ah, duck. <laughs> so weird. Okay. So that's where I came in. I can't go anywhere this way. That's the kitchen door. This way, I assume, is nothing. Okay. The controls are being a little bit weird right now. Having a little bit of trouble walking around. Uh, what's this way? Anything? Uh, ooh, a book. Nice, they got cards and everything. Lucky bastards. Alright. Now that is how you while away the zombie apocalypse. With a lot of solitaire and a lot of poker. Don't have any creaky stairs. Okay. Alright. Bedroom door. Run into that girl. I know it. You're not supposed to be in here. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Why? What will he do? Get mad at me. What does he do when he gets mad? He gets angry, and he says he's disappointed in me. And then he just loves me and wants me to be safe. That's it? Nothing else? Yeah. It's the worst. <laughs> what happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it with. Bandages, and I need to sew some of it up. It's too deep. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this applies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. <laughs> Shouldn't you be in bed? <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh my Our god. Friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. I uh, could be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. Yes, we are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Okay. I promise. Me too. Friends. Can I get back out of it? <laughs> Pinky swears forever. Man, she's I'll see tall if I can for. I find the stuff my dad uses when I get a cut. Let me look around. If she's the same age as me, she is significantly taller. I think this is it. That'll yeah. work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry, I won't. Oh no! Oh, I thought that was the door opening Thanks, from the Sarah. outside. Okay, that's peroxide. I got... Ugh. Man, I still need a lot of stuff. Oh, perfect! They have running water? No way. Oh, shit! Hey, needle. Right. It's clean. Good. Well, not anymore. Oh. I still need some bandages, though. Okay. Wow. It's really 
really kept this place up. Oh, here we go. Linen closet. Yeah. Oh. They have to have medical supplies around here somewhere. I get the feeling this is when I'm going to get caught. That man sometimes. <laughs> Hide in the shower. Go in the closet. Not the shower. Damn it. Just need to have this baby. <laughs> Let it be okay. Let it be his. Oh, shit! <sighs> oh, you cheating bitch! Yeah, I get. I changed my mind on going in the shower because I got the impression that if the linen closet was empty and everybody knew that because they lived here, they'd have no reason to open it. Because if I went in the shower and she was like, okay, let's go ahead and like take a shower or do something. Let's use this for whatever they actually use this for, they would have found me. But nobody would just open an empty linen closet for no reason. <sighs> Okay, so there's still another door I can go through. Go across the hall, and it's right here. Okay. Oh my god, you know what? I'm gonna freaking call it. Uh, oh, board game. Oh, nice! I got Risk! Awesome! I love Risk. Now that's another way to really while away the apocalypse. Playing Risk with like all the people. Oh my. Uh, okay. That was weird. Jeez. Mm. <laughs> okay. Rex. Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. Good. Got him. Sneaky. Uh. Hmm. I'm gonna take it. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Okay. Now I just gotta get out of here. I know the way back, but I'm so gonna get spotted and they're gonna like shoot me. It's like, oh, you took all shit! Uh! Even though all I took was a sewing needle. Uh, fishing line from the uh, shed, rags that no one was using, and um, peroxide. Well, peroxide they would have used, but. Damn it, Clementine, you're really packing on the pounds. You're making a lot of noise. Can I go through here? Yes, I can. Run! Get out of here! Whew. Close one. Man! Well, it's actually not a close one at all, because there's going to be someone waiting in here for me. Oh, okay. Hydrogen peroxide brand. Hydrogen peroxide. <laughs> and trophy. Fishing line. Okay. This is going to suck. Yeah, we've already got, like, uh, a medical procedure going on. This is gonna suck. Yep. Okay, so, first things first. Uh, pick it up. This would be the worst. Well, actually, I don't know. Alright, clean it. I'm good. I'm fine. So wait, did you just... Now the fun part. Did you just lose all the peroxide just then? Well, that's not good. I 
I seriously have to do this? Oh, okay, good. No. Just like last time. Just how Crystal showed me. Yeah. Uh, wait. Wait, what? Oh my god. Sorry. Because I like you a lot more than Ellie. Oh, and what? Oh, four? Jeez. For a second there, it looked like you missed. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. How is it? Good enough. Well, you calm down. <laughs> <laughs> you calm down in a heartbeat. How did you... How did that happen? There's gonna be a walker! There's gonna be a walker! I knew it! I called it. Okay, uh... Thing. Uh, I clicked. Yeah. Come on, onto the anchor. Don't make me a liar, game. Yeah! Uh. Oh. Well, shit! I didn't realize he was getting up. Ah. Okay, where do I continue? Probably at, like, the beginning of this. Oh, what the hell? I didn't realize he was getting up. Oh, all the way at the beginning of it. Okay. Kick him. Kick him. Frick. What the hell? I'm mashing Q. There. That. Oh shit. There we go. Q. Kamehame Q. In the. Ugh. Come on. There. Okay, now go for the hammer. Ugh. Just like Grandpappy Lee. Bam. Eh. Get out of here, you Holy son of a bitch. 
shit. What the? How the hell did he get in here? Little girl's tough. Still to not you bitten. Right? I'm still not bitten. I never was. And you left me out here to die. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So just save it. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn look is sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? Uh Okay. I think she's justifiably angry. <laughs> This might hurt a little. <laughs> How she looked. Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. What, are you unhappy about that? Ugh. Yeah, I don't think you'd have full control back just at having a little bandage around it. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. What do you mean? You manipulated my daughter. I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. What do you mean? I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Oh. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. Well... If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. So what do you mean by that exactly? That's what I want to know. Ramen! Awesome! Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Oh my god! Oh, that's not... Oh. Okay, so it's not... It's not ramen. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. <laughs> yeah. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. <laughs> what? Nothing. I just had a friend who lost his arm once. That's all. What's up, ass? You gonna shoot me again? Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. What happened? Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. But anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. Yeah. Well, at least that's all squared away. 
<sighs> so, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Okay, let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Well, that'd be good. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I... I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it, but it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He's the reason I keep my hair short. Nice. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone. But he saved me first. Lots of times. Well, it sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah. He was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Hmm, wouldn't that be nice? Oh, is it going to be a fishing minigame? That'd be cool. What's up? Oh, you're still here. Oh boy, not you. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. <sighs> Whose baby is it? Excuse me? If it's not Alvin's, whose is it? You shut your fucking mouth. I won't tell. I knew you were going to be a fucking problem. You got what you came here for. Now go. Yeah, now I got you by the ovaries. Not so fun, is it? Oh, God. It's like, how about in exchange for me not telling anybody, you just leave me alone? How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. <laughs> Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. What's her problem? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. Yeah. How far are these fish traps? It ain't oh, much further. Oh, okay, they're traps. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By yep. that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Yeah. <laughs> Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. K-9 
Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. <laughs> he turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. <laughs> anyway. So I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me, and of course the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. They seem Leaving very... us again. I know where the fucking river is. Man. Yeah, that seems a little uncalled for. To be really, like... So anyway, you know. I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. He doesn't hate you. Nick's father wasn't there much. And he was a piece of shit when he was. So it fell to me to keep him in line. Raise him right. Meant I couldn't just be nice Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete! Uh-oh. It's filled with Nick. zombie... Oh. Zombie fish? Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. <gasps> Wee! No! Oh. Okay, some walkers. Ah, uh, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. How? Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Uh, I'd like be to know. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. That's important information because now I'm kind of stuck here. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. Okay. Uh, anything on this guy? No. Okay bodies. Uh, this guy has a Hell's Angels, um, jacket. Maybe he's like a biker? It's a biker gang. Fusro Da. It doesn't say Fusro Da. This one's shot, too. Through the head? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. Yeah, I'll just pull the bullet out of his head. <laughs> Sandbar. Hey, Nick. What's up? Can I help? I got it. Okay. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky-dink pissing match. What was it, then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! What if someone's alive, Nick? Who cares? Cause they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, you know, Clem. You wanna be I... useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this outfit. <laughs> Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. 
Probably shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Good job. Okay. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. You know, I'm pretty sure Pete's voice, uh, the guy who voices Pete, is a guy who voices somebody in Skyrim. Um, the guy in the Thieves Guild, and also the very first merchant you talk to in Riverwood. I think it's that guy. Oh, why do I gotta walk all the way over here? Oh, shit. Uh... That one's gonna get up, isn't it? Because, like, he wasn't shot through the brain. <gasps> oh, no! Is Wait, wasn't that Krista? No? Oh, okay. I thought it might have been Krista. Even though she was... Well, I mean, even when Lee turned, he turned really, really pale. So, yeah, I thought it was Krista. Okay, this is the one that's gonna get up and trigger a quick time event. Whoa, look at that! It's like some kind of super amethyst. Can I get it? No? Okay. Attack me, you son of a bitch. I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Hey, my bag! <coughs> Wait a minute. <coughs> What happened to you? <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me. <coughs> Please. No. Fine. Here. Thank you. Ah! Oh, shit. Pete! Oh, good. I'm fine. I'm fine. You got just, bit. Just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Uh oh. Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Come this way! Ah, bitch! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of I'll you! I'll cover you! We gotta get out of here! Get over here, goddammit! Uh... Did you listen to me once? Just one time? I've got ammo! Listen to me, dammit! I... Go to Nick! Nick! Pete! Oh. Sorry. No. Oh my god. Well. Pete. No. He's dead. We have to go. Could have saved him. No. Oh. You just leave him. What could I have done? I didn't have a weapon. Oh shit, this already the end? What are we going to do? Someone's outside. It's a zombie. Oh. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? I can't keep going. I figure we got about four or five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Shit! Someone's alive from the first game. Either that or it's just Krista. Probably just Krista. Okay. Let's see here.
Oh, wow. Okay. So, uh, 83% of people helped Krista. Uh, 81% killed the dog. 87% accepted Nick's apology. Uh, 67% gave water to the dying man. And 47% of people went with Nick. The reason I didn't go with Nick is because he was already bitten. I mean, if he's bitten, he's done. You know what I mean? So, like, of course, well, I mean, no, she did see it. She saw it, didn't she? I think she saw the bite. I got the the indication that she saw the bite happen. Or maybe not happen, but she saw the bite. So, in that case, I'm going to go with Nick because he's going to die and cause tons and tons of drama anyway. Not to mention he could put more people in danger. So, I went with Nick. So, yeah. All right. So, that is all of Chapter 1. Oh, my God. Oh, now I want to play the second one, but I don't think I should right now. But, oh, my God. That was good. Okay, so that is the first episode of The Walking Dead Season 2. Oh, my God. I'm so excited. This is, like, already so good. Uh, Carl Muckin... Muckin helped. Oh, no. Oh, please. I don't want the songs. Oh. Okay, you know what? I'm going to end it off here. Next time on The Walking Dead Season 2, we're going to do the next episode. It didn't say what it was, but we're going to do that. So, see you then.